Hey, good morning and happy Thursday to you guys. Uh, more and more I think about how Trump supporters refuse to acknowledge what the rest of the world sees, uh, what the majority of people believe, um, what all, almost all newspaper, television, the Associated Press, uh, the British press, the entire world reports uh, about, for instance, uh, no, no incriminating evidence whatsoever against Biden's son, um, the Ukraine, everything. Uh, whenever Trump supporters are faced with the facts, they, deny, they, they make up this scenario where it's lying media. They can't trust the media. And even Donald Trump supports that with his, uh, he came out with some shit about television lawyers. The Democrats were using television lawyers. I don't know if that means they're taking them from law and order, like actors and, you know, I, God knows what he's talking about. But here's the, 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 real, the real thing is whenever this cult of Trump is, is, is faced with the facts, they deny it. They, they say, hey, oh, it's not true because that's a, it's a conspiracy. It's a hoax. And the correlation between them and flat earth supporters, flat earth believers is to me is amazing. Flat earthers, they're, they, all the proof in the world, the entire world, and the scientists, the pictures, everything. And no, no, uh, it's a conspiracy. And if you, you're a part of the conspiracy, you're a shill. Uh, NASA, it's all a conspiracy. Just like uh, with Trump supporters in this deep state this ridiculous deep state, deep state conspiracy to this day, for the life of me, I want to know what the deep state is. I want to know evidence. Show me pictures. Are, are they meeting in a bar somewhere? Are they, <laughs> seriously, are they meeting in a hotel room? Uh, is there tape recordings? Something, man, other than, uh, you know, innuendo that there's a Deep State, it sounds like a freaking Will Smith spy movie there. Or, you know, or the fucking Matrix. You guys have been watching too many, too many of these movies, man. Uh, but the correlation between Trump supporters and Trump supporters to their dying day will say, Trump's a good man, everybody else is lying. You know, they reach for the Trump, they see the Trump tweets. That's, all, that's their information. A, a few Facebook pages uh, bashing libertards. And Fox News. That is their sources. Just like flat earthers. Get their only information from YouTube, other flat earthers. That's where they base all, you know, and that's all fact to them. They're doing research, you know, and uh, they're getting all their, their hardcore, truthful info from other flat earth YouTubers and Trump supporters. They're getting their facts, their, uh, their true news from Fox News. I just saw today. I follow uh, on Facebook. I follow this uh, uh, page called PolitiFact. It is a non-biased think tank. Um, they they go after the Democrats. They go after the Republicans. Their main goal they want a Pulitzer Prize. Their main goal is to bring the truth out, and they'll they'll go after the Democrats. They'll go after liberals. Liberals. They'll go after the Trump. They'll go after anybody. Whoever's lying, they'll tell you about it. So that's right. That's. I can base some some truth on that. And just today, I saw. Uh, oh shit! I forgot where I was going with this, but it was just uh, it was another uh, ridiculous claim by Trump um, or Fox News. A uh, Fox News had made uh, was already twisting. Uh, Politifact brought to light that during the hearings yesterday, Fox News was already putting up. N untrue, semi-true, twisted facts about the case. So they're presenting false news to, to the public. So this is, this is it, the correlation is unbelievable. To their dying day, Trump supporters will, he's a good man, he, you know, and whatever happens, he was railroaded, you know. They will never, ever, you know, it is their life, it is their, their hero, they will, they will never, I truly believe they will never change. And uh, just like flat earthers, they're a dying day. Uh, you know, it's, it's, it's what their whole identity is about. Um, you know, it makes them feel good. There's some part of them, of them that's angry or something, and that makes them feel better. This, this Trump thing, this, uh, this reckless tweeting fool in the Oval Office, this racist fool in the Oval Office, somehow fills a, uh, calms a fear in them. 
Same thing with uh, flat earthers. You know, they're scared that, oh my God, human beings are the only things in this huge, gigantic universe. That means we're insignificant and we mean nothing and it scares the shit out of them. And they need a reason and they will never, to their dying day, admit that there's space. That, you know, this is the truth. Because it scares them. It's it's become part of their entire psyche. Their whole character is ba their whole uh, mental makeup is is built on that supposed fact that the Earth is flat. And just like with Trump, there's something about Trump's you know Trump just calms their fears and makes them feel better. And and uh, to me, they all look so angry and so concerned about what everybody else is doing or getting or being allowed to do. They seem so... It's always about everybody else. You know, these people are getting too much. I want more. These people shouldn't be allowed to marry. These people shouldn't be allowed uh, immigration. You know, I should be allowed more of this, more guns. It, it's all about... Uh, where they rank amongst their neighbors too, which to me is a sure way to live an unhappy life. It is not concentrating on making yourself, you know, to me, I want to be a better, better than I was yesterday. I honestly, I'm not concerned with what anybody else is doing around me. I want to be a better person than I was yesterday. That's my goal. If my goal isn't to see what my neighbor, you know, how much my neighbor's making this year and make more than him. And otherwise I'm a failure. It's a sure way to lead an unhappy life. It really is. So, okay, let the, th I'm sure you guys, uh, I'm sure you Trump supporters didn't even make it this far. Let the thumbs down begin. I'm going to guess at least seven thumbs down on this one. At least, maybe eight. Oh, no, no, you know what? Because now I'm insulting the Trump supporters and the flat earthers. So that's a double dose of thumbs down. Shit, I might even hit 12 thumbs down with this one. Let's see. Go for it, guys. Have a good Thursday.